Hi everyone, nice to see you again. Well, my name is Laudai Vasadani and in this video, I would like to explain and present my teaching media for reading activity. And this one is for senior high school. It can be for the second or the third grade. So, uh, this media, I called it job switch. So, without any further ado, let's check it out. Well, this media is very simple, right? However, it's very useful to enhance the student's reading skills. So, this media is also convenient for the teacher because it doesn't take a lot of space. You just can put it here or you can put it in a small bag and you can bring it in every classes. And then to make it to make the media, you just need some colorful cards and then some envelope and then pen and marker so you can make your own card you can you know choose your own color and to make it more beautiful so it's up to you what you have to do is that you have to put the questions in front of the envelope and then the error control will be inside the envelope so this will be the error control to guide the students discussions uh, so that if the student have some difficulty in understanding the story they will have some clues inside the envelope so they will not be confused in the middle of the discussions okay now we will see how this media works in reading activities let's check it out Okay, because I got job number one, so I will read the questions for you guys, okay? The first question is, what is the broken heart and the dead bird represent? Okay, number two. Who is number two? Me, I'm number two. Okay, so I will try to answer the questions. Well, guys, uh, in my opinion, the broken heart and the dead bird represents the prince and the little bird kindness i think because because the god said at the end of the story that that is the best thing that they can get from the city so i think it represents the kindness of both the little bird and the prince well i think that's all Number two, three, here, okay. Uh, well, thank you, number two, for your explanations. And uh, I agree with your opinions that the broken heart and the little, the dead bird, yeah, and the dead bird represents the happy prince and the little bird kindness. I also think that the broken heart and the dead bird also represents their loyalty and their sacrifices to help people who live in, in poverty in that city so because the reason why the god said that that is the best thing that they can get from the city i think it's because something like kindness uh, sacrifices loyalty it's, it will remain forever that kind of thing will remain forever so i think that's why the god said that is the best thing So, wait a second. Okay, so because I'm number four, I will try to summarize our discussions for these questions. 
Well, the crisis is what is the broken heart and the dead birds represent. Person number two, you say that they represent the happy prince and the little bird kindness, right? And then person number three, you say that they also represent the happy prince and the little bird sacrifices and their loyalty towards people who live in that city. So, and you guys agree that the reason is the evidence is that because the gods say that that is the best thing that they can get from uh, the city and also because you said that that kind of things like kindness, loyalty, that will remain forever, right? Okay, so that's the end of our discussions for the first questions. Okay, let's go to the next questions and before that, let's switch our job. So that is one of the example of how this media will works in reading activity. Well, the allocation time for using this media in reading activity is around 20 to 30 minutes. So at first, I will let the student read the text first, read the text first, and then they will do post activity, post reading activities using job switch. And then after that, I will try to explain some important things that uh, the story from some important things from the story, so that we will have uh, like the same understanding from the story that we have read before. Most students find that reading is boring, so we need an activity, we need a media to engage the student. So this media, the job switch, is really suitable for uh, to engage, to improve the student's reading skills. Why? Because through this post-reading activity, we can give every student a reason, a chance to speak of their opinion. So everybody must uh, talk, they have to share their opinion. Because uh, like what uh, I already explained before, we have to form a small group, uh, they work in a small group and each person have different roles. So they have to not only share their opinions, but they also have to compare and contrast their opinion. So they have to know what each other thinking about the story. They have to, and in this, in the process, they will build their critical thinking skill because they have to compare and contrast each other answer and they will, ble- they will build collaborative work and what they read is not only in their memory in a short in a short moment but what they read will remain longer because they discuss together because they try to understanding together because uh, they not only read and answering questions they not only try to memorize memorize things but they also uh, understanding they analyze the story and that's why what they read will remain longer and i think it's a really good thing it's a really good Uh, media to use to enhance to improve the students reading skills well guys that's all I can explain about my teaching media that's called job switch I hope it can be useful for you I hope it can give you a little bit of inspirations and also I would like to say thank you to Miss Mega and to all of my friends in language teaching media class I have a really nice have really great time with you guys in the semester even though well we have to work from home i hope you guys stay healthy anywhere you anywhere you are so goodbye and see you when i see you